the first round of the Eastern Conference playoffs. The Cleveland Cavaliers have showed up hungry and determined to fight for what they believe is rightfully theirs. Will they be able to break the stalemate and come out on top against the New York Knicks? Round one of the NBA playoffs continues. We're ready for game three on 2K Sports. It's the Eastern Conference quarterfinals and a series that's all knotted up in one apiece. With Hall of Famers Grant Hill and Doris Burke, this is Brian Anderson. Joining us from the sidelines, Ali LaForce. Here are the five for the Cavaliers. And a lot of size for them, with both Mobley and Allen watching the paint. Garland runs point with Mitchell at the two. And it's Okoro in at the small forward position. And for New York, Randall and Hartenstein together down low. Jalen Brunson is out there with Emmanuel quickly. And it's Barrett in at the three slot. You take a look at the Knicks. This is a team that's in great position to take control of this series. Yeah, they really positioned themselves very well in this first round. The fans will be urging them on tonight. It'll be the Knicks off the tip. Brunson with it. Randall outside. No good from outside. Given his range, you'd expect him to capitalize on that open. Garland finds Mitchell. Allen a screen. Back to Garland. Mobley outside. Down to five on the shot clock. The three from Okoro. The Knicks with the rebound. Outside Brunson. Hartenstein a screen. Brunson passes to Hartenstein. Quickly outside. New York needs to get one up quick. The timer ticks. Brunson misses. And here comes Cleveland. Garland with the ball. And it's Brunson picking him up. Outside Mitchell. Launches a three. Hartenstein pulls it in. And this is exactly who you want taking that shot. You just missed it. Brunson against Garland. Outside Brunson. Randall a screen on Garland. And here's Brunson from the arc. The rebound by Allen. Boy, that's 0 for 3 in the early going. Just a little out of sync. Mitchell, the pass to Allen. Mitchell against quickly. Let's it go from deep. And it's Donovan Mitchell with a three. Well, Donovan Mitchell, a three-level scorer, and fires away from deep with reckless abandon, folks. Randall, a screen on Garland. Brunson with it. Now guarded by Mobley. And that one's good for Brunson. So that's what you call playing big. He just stays committed to the attack mode. Well, made for a height disadvantage. He recognizes that and still able to score it. Now here's Garland. Missed it. Now 0 for 1 on this game. Well, this is the kind of shot we've come to expect him to make. He's got to be upset with that one. Outside for Randall. Brunson against Garland. And that one's good for Brunson. Now, this is what makes Jalen Brunson special. You've got to knock down contested shots. Mr. Brunson up to the task. Pass to Mobley. Here's Okoro. Outside Mitchell. Mobley up top. Shoots over Randall. Tips. And there's the shot clock violation. Couldn't get the shot off in time. And so Randall will bring it up for New York. Randall on the screen. Here's Brunson. 
Mobley grabs the board. The Cavs have gone one of five to start things off. Pass to Allen. Here's Okoro. Mobley with it. Runs and defending. And Mobley throws it down. Man, that is a big time tough finish. Evan Mobley doesn't back down. Randall on the screen. Now quickly, checked by Mitchell. For three, Randall drains the triple. Well, you cannot sleep on Julius Randall. Catch and shoot jumper. Okay, Julius, we see you. Allen with a screen on Barrett. Pass to Allen. And here's Mitchell. Over quickly. And it's Allen who slams it home. Yeah, that's the big man lingering around the hoop. Jared Allen smartly gets the bucket on the follow. Quickly outside. Back to Randall. Clock at four. He hits it just before the shot clock expires. Randall's got five. Well, the strength of Julius Randall is an obvious asset. This guy, despite being undersized, is able to finish from contact. Now here's Mitchell. There's the three. This is another, just one of four from the floor. It's been that kind of quarter for him. The shot has just been unreliable. Garland against Barrett. The Cavaliers with a rebound. Allen's got four rebounds now. Pass to Garland. Mobley, a screen on Brunton. Garland, pass to Mobley. And Mobley throws it down. Here is a guy who is not shy about sharing the basketball. If you are open, Darius Garland will find you. Randall outside. Back to Brunton. Randall outside. Three-pointer. The rebound by Allen. Allen's got five rebounds tonight. Garland against Brunson. Up top, Allen. Pass to Mitchell. Inside. And Mobley throws it down. If you're going to roll as the screen setter, as Evan Mobley does there, you've got to be able to catch and finish, and he does just that. Barrett with it. Over a Coro. Drains it from nine feet away. This guy is a pick-your-poison kind of player. Very hard defensively to cover all your bases with him. Pass to Allen. Brunson against Garland. Back to Allen. Fires from 14. And there are the Cavaliers with another bucket. I'll tell you what, Jared Allen showing you he's got the mid-range game in his arsenal. Pretty jumper. Timeout call, the Knicks.
almost an entire new group here. Sims, he's checked in for Hartenstein. Hart comes in for Barrett. Grimes, he's checked in for Quickly. And it's DiVincenzo in for Brunson. And the Cavaliers will go for a different look here. Wade, he's checked in for Jared Allen. Niang comes in for Evan Mobley. Jackson, he's checked in for Okoro. And Jerome subbed in for Donovan Mitchell. DiVincenzo against Garland. For three, Randall fires in the triple. Randall's got eight. All right, defensively now, you've got to find a way to slow this guy down because he's putting it to you. Here's Jerome. Good work defensively by Randall. So far, rebounding has been a focal point for them. Here's DiVincenzo. And it's Niang with a rebound. The Cavs trailing. Garland scanning the floor. Niang outside. Five to shoot. Here's Jerome. Yeah, that one's good. And the Cavaliers lead by one. They're finding ways to get the ball into the paint. Five consecutive buckets to the paint. Ooh, power down with both hands. Here, put your head down and go to work. That's what they need to do. Boy, the tide is running one way and then shifts back in the other direction. I've lost count of how many lead changes we've had here tonight. Here's Jerome. Shoots from 14. And now the Knicks on the break. And the foul is called. He missed it, so he's got a couple of free throws coming his way. First team foul. Quentin Grimes. At the line, two shots. Shoot two. First free throw is good. So for the Knicks. Knight, he's checked in for Sims. Roby comes in for Julius Randle. And it's Jalen Brunson in for DiVincenzo. And Cleveland with a change here, too. Mitchell's checked in. Both shots good from the strike. We've got 123 left in the first quarter. Pass to Jerome. Here's Mitchell. Fires from deep. And he missed again. Now one of five. He's lost his rhythm completely this quarter. But he's determined to stay after it. Here's Grimes. The three. The rebound by Jackson. It's tough to get open in this league. And when you do, it hurts not to capitalize. And the officials violation. signal the backcourt violation. Not careful there. So for the Knicks. Sims comes in for Knight. And it's DiVincenzo in for Roby. And here are the Knicks now. It's a three-point game. Outside Brunson. Three-pointer. Cavaliers with a rebound. Well, they have the advantage, but you still feel like this guy needs to find a way to get himself going. Here's Jerome. Brunson defending. Niang a screen. The three from Mitchell. Buries it from three. Mitchell. Mitchell's got six. He does not require much space to get that jumper off. Donovan Mitchell working right now. Brunson taking his time here. Fires the three. Hits the trifecta. Brunson's got his third bucket of the night. This guy won't give an inch. Brunson answers back with a three of his own. You've got to love it. What a performance for Julius Randle. He has been the story for New York. Eight points in the quarter, showing how effective he can be. We'll be back in a moment.
And welcome back to our coverage of Game 3 on 2K Sports. All right, guys, some stats here. The scoring breakdown for New York. Well, in today's NBA, the three-point shot is so valuable. They realize this, and that's why they're continuing to drain as many as they can. And they've also shown dominance in the paint so far tonight, really putting the work in down low. So for Cleveland right now, Mitchell out there with Ty Jerome. Then there's Dean Wade, then it's Jackson, and it's Niang in at the power forward position. Wade, the pass to Jerome, and he drives in. Some solid defense from Brunson. I'll tell you, everything went right in terms of execution. He just can't get it to go. Back to Hart. Six on the shot clock. From deep three-point range, it's rebounded by Wade. And Cleveland's shooting just 42% so far in the game. Jerome passes to Mitchell. Spider spinning the web from deep. That's about intense focus from Donovan Mitchell. That defense was outstanding. He just is better offensively. Pass to Hart. Outside Brunson. Quarter number two with just over a minute of play. That one falls. Oh, what a mid-air adjustment. You know, he had to alter his release point, but didn't let it throw off the shot. Now here's Jackson, guarded closely. And Dante DiVincenzo is going to pick up the foul. That's his first foul. With Roby, he's checked in for New York. Now into the lineup for your New York Knicks. Number 18, Isaiah Roby. Here's Jerome. Brunson defending. Back to Nia. From deep. Hart with the defensive effort. And lockdown defense against one of the best three-point shooters in the league. Ooh. From 13. And it's New York with another. We know that the defense in today's NBA wants to take away the rim and the three. Mr. Brunson says, I'll take that mid-range. DiVincenzo with a steal. Here we go, one-on-one. -on -one. Take it off in transition. Jalen Brunson. You can see it. Once this guy gets his rhythm, he is so hard to slow down. What an excellent night for him and his team. Jerome passes to Mitchell. Mitchell. Mitchell does not let that 6-1 frame deter him from going in the paint. This guy has got so much confidence. Brunson finds Steven Chinzo. Right side Hart. Pass to Grimes. Shot clock at five. Lays it up and banks it in. And once more this half, they find a way to get great position inside. The Cavaliers have gone 2 of 4 here in the second quarter. Here's Jerome. Brunson defending. Jerome passes to Mitchell. Puts up a 3. From outside, Mitchell is good. They're going to have to pay more attention to him on the perimeter. He's hit four three-pointers already today. Screen by Roby. Oh, a clear foul there on the missed shot. So he'll get a pair at the line. Well, one of the last guys you want to send to the free throw line, Jalen Brunson has proven Jaylen he can Brunson. knock these in. At the line, two shots. The first one falls. Well, because Jalen Brunson is such a terrific decision maker, you can tell how confident and comfortable this team is when he runs the offense. Hardenstein, he's checked in for New York, quickly comes in for DiVincenzo. Jared Allen, he's checked in for Cleveland. Okoro comes in for Jackson. 
Both free throws, good from Brunson. The way he's shooting free throws tonight, you simply don't want to put him there. Quickly against Mitchell. Allen with a screen on quickly. The three from Mitchell, and it's Allen who slams it home. Well, Jared Allen getting open off the screen and roll, such a big target. He can really read the floor. Precision pass in rhythm. The Cavaliers have gone four for six here in the second. Outside Mitchell. Here's Jerome. Runs in defending. Jerome passes to Mitchell. And another basket for Cleveland. And he's single-handedly trying to keep them alive. Terrific scoring quarter. Will it be enough, though? Outside Brunson. Sneak it inside. It's Brunson. <laughs> They're not messing around. Five of their last six buckets have come from the interior. Mitchell against quickly. Niang a screen. A floater. And it's Mitchell. The miss. Boy, in that close, he's almost automatic. Boy, that's pretty good defense. Wow. Brunson finds quickly. Now it's hard. Pass to Brunson. The three is up. Yes, sir! Brunson for three! Boy, whenever this team has needed a bucket, Jalen Brunson has been there right now in complete command of this ball game. And so it's Mitchell who brings up the ball for Cleveland. Trailing by eight. With the seven-footer. Now here's Allen. Here's Okoro. He's scoreless. Good. Well, Okoro is a team-first guy that wants to involve his teammates. Pretty pass there. Pass to Hart. To the middle. And Brunson with the bucket on the assist from Hart. Brunson's got 22 points. A steady start has turned into a spectacular second quarter for him. From deep, Mitchell. Again, the miss by Mitchell. He didn't make them pay for that weak defense, but they just can't rely on him to miss those kind of shots. Brunson passes to Grimes. Pass to Brunson. Outside Hart. Hartenstein a screen. From the high post. The Cavaliers pull it in. Here's Jerome. Here's Okoro. And here's Allen. He's covered by Hart. Niang outside. Here's the three. He's now one for two with that bucket. They are shooting it well from beyond the arc right now. For New York, they've gotten eight of their first ten to go. Great shooting here in the second quarter. Now a timeout called by New York.
Randall for the Knicks. Randall, he's checked in for Hart, and it's R.J. Barrett in for Grimes. Mobley, he's checked in for Cleveland. Darius Garland comes in for Mitchell. Brunson. The rebound by Garland. Cleveland has gone 5 of 12 from three-point range tonight. Pass to Allen. Shot from 12. That one rolls around and rims out. The Knicks with the lead. Brunson passes to quickly. Brunson against Garland. Shoots from the line. Yep, count it. Brunson's got 24. The consistency as a jump shooter. Jalen Brunson with that quick, compact release. Here's Akuro, guarded by Barrett. Pass to Allen. Back to Okoro. And the layup is good after a nice lead pass. Okay, Jared Allen, we see you making that look for a big man. That's a pretty pass. Here's Randall, covered by Mobley. Randall can't hit. Cleveland has got three of five to fall from beyond the three-point line in the second. Here's Jerome. Brunson defending. Pass to Allen. Over quickly. Allen can't get it to go. New York has gone one of two from deep in the second quarter. Outside Barrett. Back to quickly. Brunson with it. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. That one's on Darius Garland. Well, despite his size, Jalen Brunson loves to operate in the painted area. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. Free throw good from Brunson. He does a great job of drawing contact and getting himself to the line, something he didn't do in the first period. Hart's checked in for quickly. Hits both from the strike. Yeah, they, they're really cashing in more at the line here in the second quarter. And so it's Garland who brings up the ball for the Cleveland Cavaliers. Seven-point differential. Going inside. And he's in the books. Now one for two. Hey, they're just getting pushed around inside. New York shooting a fantastic 57%. Outside Hart. 54 seconds left in the first half of basketball. Randall outside. Clock at six. Pass to Barrett. Fires for three. The Cavaliers pull it in. Allen's got six rebounds now in the game. Here's Akuro. Now here's Allen. Give him eight. Now Garland. Cleveland needs to get off a shot. The three from Okoro. And the basket's good. Off the assist from Garland. Garland's got his third assist of the night. Outside Barrett. Hardenstein a screen. Pass to Brunson. And it's good. Here, the officials may want to take a look at it on the replay monitor. Well, these teams are going to have the previous play is over here and see if he got it off in time. 
Yeah, they're going to review that shot to make sure he got it off in time, but I think it's going to count. After the review, the ruling on the floor is overturned. So the replay was conclusive. All overturned. Grant, that one's going to count. And B.A., you can argue against replay all you want. But at the end of the day, you want it to be a level playing field. You want the call to be correct. It's been all about Jalen Brunson for New York. He's been doing damage on the offensive end all night. 28 points in this one. All right, Allie's ready to go. She's courtside. Hey, Allie. Thanks so much. I'm here with Coach Tom Thibodeau. And, Tom, what's it going to take down the stretch to win this ball game? I think just tough defense, take good shots, not turn the ball over, play smart. Back to the basics. Thanks, Coach. Allie, as always, thank you. We'll be back right after the break for the third quarter here on 2K Sports. Some great postseason action in the first half of play. A healthy lead has been built for the New York Knicks. Well, they've got this crowd on the edge of their seats. It's been one heck of a game. And if they continue to play well, they're going to take control of this series. Wouldn't that be a nice treat for these fans? And looking at where the Knicks stand in this series, they were able to take a game on the road, capturing home court advantage. Shaq, how important is game three for them? Well, game three is always huge. They took care of business on the road. Now they have to hit you guys to the big word. Now they have to capitalize on it. Ooh. Well, it won't be easy, but I'm going to make a prediction, guys. You ready? No, but Whoever go ahead. Whoever wins this game three, they win the series. That is bold, Kenny. I sort of like it. Thanks for joining us. Time to head back over to the third quarter with Brian Anderson. Great to have you with us again as we return to our coverage of round one. You look at Jalen Brunson, what a contribution. He was getting into the lane easily that first half. It's just relentless. Now this guy is such a good finisher on the move, and so far the defense has not been able to counter it. And thanks for sticking with us as this round one game continues. Barrett is the three, Randall the four. 
Emmanuel quickly is out there with Jalen Brunson. And it's Hartenstein in at the pivot spot, manning the middle. That's Tom Thibodeau's five as we get going in the second half. And here's Randall. He'll bring it up for New York. They lead by four. Here's Hartenstein. Back to Brunson. Pass to Hartenstein. Yes, and a nice assist from Brunson. Hartenstein's got his second bucket of the night. That's just outstanding floor awareness from Jalen Brunson. Doesn't matter if he's at the one or the two. He always makes the right play. Garland against Brunson. Throws it up high. Allen can't get it to go. Well, he saw the play coming together, but the timing was just a little off. It was a really good thought, for sure. But the lob has got to be better than that. Garland against Brunson from inside. Kicks it out to Barrett. Takes a three. Sinks the tray. And now a nine-point New York lead. Well, you have to understand, spacing is provided when you can make threes. R.J. Barrett delivers. Pass to Garland. Mobley is screen on Brunson. Garland for three. Drills it from deep. Garland's got five points. <laughs> That's how you up the ante. Come right back at him. And you would expect nothing less from these two. Taking pride and making plays. Mobley with the block. Shooters have got to be careful and understand Evan Mobley is an elite shot blocker. He's going to let you feel him now, guys. Randall can't hit. The Cavaliers have gone just one of three in the second half. Pass to Okoro. And now around two minutes gone by in this half. Allen with it. Outside Mitchell. Over Brunson. Ooh, Mitchell! A tough two! You get the sense that a little bit of pressure makes Donovan Mitchell elevate his game. Under duress of the shot clock, no problem. Pass to Brunson. A little over two and a half minutes off the clock in this final half of play. Down low. Here's Hardenstein. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. And he drops the first. makes one of two and the second one misses. Cleveland has gone one of two shooting from the perimeter since halftime. Here's Garland. And the shot goes. Garland's got five points now in the quarter. Boy, how about the nimbleness to overcome the defense inside. Darius Garland makes his opportunities. Brunson passes to Barrett. Quickly from outside. Sends it home from three-point land. And the Knicks lead by six. You simply must play better defense than that. This guy is too good for distance. Outside Garland. Mobley is screen on Brunson. Garland finds Mobley. The Knicks pull it in. Hartenstein's got rebound number seven tonight. Just over three and a half minutes through the third. Well, R.J. Barrett comes with an aggressiveness and assertiveness. This guy wants to capitalize on the defender's mistake. Nice. R.J. Barrett at the line. Two shots. First one at the line is good. 
I think one of the things I most admire about R.J. Barrett's game, he can do a little bit of everything. He can score it, board it, pass it at a high level. This young man can play the game. And Barrett drops them both. In the third quarter with just over three and a half minutes off the clock. Here's Okoro, guarded by Barrett. Here's Okoro. He's got five. Here's Garland. Here's Allen. And it's Allen who slams it home. Boy, that's a little bit of toughness and concentration. Jared Allen under duress of the defense. Nicely done. Now a timeout called by New York. The Knicks have gone three of five from the field in this third quarter. Pass to Randall. Back to Barrett. It's rebounded by Cleveland. Here's Okoro. He's got five. Outside Mitchell. Right side Barrett. And it's Randall with the jam. Well, the emphatic finish from Julius Randall. Get off your feet, young sir. And so it's Mitchell who brings up the ball for Cleveland. Trailing by eight. Mobley on the screen. Pass to Okoro. Takes the three. Hardenstein pulls it in. Hardenstein's got rebound number eight here already in the game. Quickly against Allen. Randall outside. Quickly from outside. And the Knicks, another three. That's two things right there for R.J. Barrett. It's awareness and unselfishness. Pretty pass. Garland against Brunson. Mitchell, a screen on Brunson. Here's Garland. And the baseline jumper goes down. Garland's got nine. Listen, you give a good shooter that kind of look, and it's going to go in. Garland against Brunson. Randall, a screen on Garland. Brunson passes to Randall. Can't bury it. His fifth miss in nine tries. From deep, Mitchell. Randall pulls down the board. Well, the defense clearly was not interested in guarding him from downtown. They're very fortunate he missed. Quickly outside. Six to shoot. Back to Randall. 
Pass to Hardenstein. Now Barrett. The fader. Outside Brunson. There's the triple. The Cavaliers pull it in. Allen's got double-digit rebounds now in the game. Here's Okoro. Here's Mobley. Oh, and makes it with the kiss. Give him eight. We know unequivocally Evan Mobley has length. He's got timing. This guy eats up rebounds. Now a timeout called by New York. I don't think this timeout is just to give the guys a breather. Coach is looking to switch things up. And as you know, it's what comes after that gives you some sense of what has changed. the Knicks. Hart's checked in for Hartenstein. Grimes comes in for Barrett. And it's DiVincenzo in for Brunson. Finds quickly. Back to Hart. The three. Cavaliers with a rebound. Here's Jerome. Nia, right side. Out to Garland. Pass to Wade from behind the arc. That shot missing. And I'm surprised that didn't go down. I mean, I'm sure he is, too. Grimes. It's tipped. And it's going to be out of bounds. New York will have another go. The Knicks making a switch here. McBride's checked in. And Cleveland with a change here, too. Jackson, he's checked in for Okoro. Passes to Grimes. Handle a screen on Jackson. Here's Grimes. Defended by Jackson. Shot clock at six. Nice shot by DiVincenzo. And just totally relentless. Only increasing the intensity level. One thing I enjoy is watching players who don't pay attention to the score. You lock in on the moment and play the right way. From 12 feet. And he drops that one in. Jerome's got his second basket on the night. There he is, showing off his low post skills. Go to work, young man. Pass to Hart. Here's McBride, guarded by Garland. A minute 42 left in the third. Here's Grimes, defended by Nia. A nice shot by Grimes. Grimes has got six. They've toned down their three-point attack in the second half, looking to protect the lead with higher percentage shots. Outside Garland, and there's
There's the screen. Hauled in by DiVincenzo. That's a shot he'd like, Mac. He's usually going to make those. To the right side. Randall, right side. Oh, nice finish from the low block. That one's good. And it's a 12-point Nick lead. Boy, you love the determination from Julius Randle. This guy has a knack for scoring against good defense. Here's Jerome. He's covered by Hart. Piang, that's good. Listen, everyone knows what kind of shooter this guy is. Just his presence on the floor creates space. Pass to Grimes. Outside, DiVincenzo. And there's the whistle. The illegal screen is the call. You can get away with one once in a while, but it looked like he wasn't completely set on that pick. I don't think there's any question. There are so many rules that favor the offense these days. You've got to be able to equal things out when an illegal screen is set. 30 seconds left to play in the third. Niang outside. Niang a screen. Out left to the wing. From outside the arc. And the Cavaliers, another three. There's 18 seconds left in the third quarter here. Randall outside. Comes up empty down low. And so it's New York with a six-point lead at the close of the quarter. What has them in front right now, by and large, they're taking great shots. We'll be right back with you shortly. And a worthy candidate tonight as we take a look at our State Farm Assist of the Game. You talk about painting a magnificent picture with that, Don. Just a great decision and a perfect delivery. We call that putting it right in the pocket. And he knew what to do with it once it was there. Hello, everyone. Thank you for joining 2K Sports and our coverage of this first round. On the court right now for Cleveland. George Niang out there with Justin Jackson. Then there's Mitchell. Then it's Ty Jerome. And it's Wade in at the five. Defensively, they've got to get more bodies in the paint. That's three straight field goals from below the free throw line. Mitchell, a screen on Brunson. Jerome passes to Mitchell. Off target with the three. What a nice individual defensive effort right there. Did a great job contesting. To the inside. Here's Brunson. Banked it in off the glass. Brunson's got four points in the quarter. Yeah, don't be fooled by the height, guys. Brunson is a terrific finisher inside. Here's Jerome. The eight outside. Jacks up a three. It's Brunson with the rebound. Well, the Knicks shooting 55% for the game so far. How about that well-timed drop-off? Jalen Brunson just knows where to put the basketball. Cleveland has gone 0 for 2 from outside here in the fourth quarter. Back to Mitchell. Puts up a deep three. Knocks it down from distance. Mitchell's got 21 points in the game. Man, they're having a hard time defending the triple. That's three in a row. Hard with a basket on the assist by Brunson. Brunson's got five assists tonight. And trust me, when the D's slow to react, he'll be the first guy to make them pay. And that's typical of this guy. He's always reading the situation, reacting quickly, and capitalizing. Pass to the A. Here's Jerome. And there's a pick over Brunson. 
target. That one's good. Defensively, you can't afford to get stuck on the pick. You know exactly what that takes. It takes energy, it takes activity, it takes intensity. Second chance shot. Brunson misses. Cleveland has gone one for three in the fourth quarter from range. Jackson can't get it to go. And so it's Hart with it. He brings it up for New York. Here's Brunson. And that one's on target from the wing. Brunson's got six points in the quarter. Deep into the game, you rely on players like him to keep delivering. Mitchell against Steven Tenzo. Mitchell's shot is good. Boy, Mitchell just focused on the basket. Not an easy guy to knock off course. Pass to Grimes. Brunson with it. For three, DiVincenzo. The basket is good. Off the assist from Brunson. And the Knicks lead by 12. Now you have to extend that defense. I mean, you really have to stay connected to him at all times. Well, you know this. This is a guy who's looking for his shot the whole time. You have to know who you're guarding. KYP, know your personnel. Cleveland calls timeout. And this late game timeout, getting a breather here. Important for the players to recharge. This is where you have a chance to get rehydrated with some Gatorade. He's checked in for New York. Quickly comes in for DiVincenzo. And a switch here also for Cleveland. Okoro's checked in. Let's check in with our reporter, Allie LaForce. Hey team, I was able to catch the message that J.B. Bickerstaff was giving to his team. And he was adamant that they need to tighten up their D. That lack of communication at that end has led to breakdowns, wide open shooters, and easy buckets. He sounded pretty frustrated, guys. All right, appreciate it, Allie. Here's Okoro. Pass to Jerome. Six on the shot clock. The three ball. And Grimes pulls it down for New York. They've gotten six of eight shots to fall during this fourth. Quickly, outside. Here's Grimes. Pass to Brunson. And down it goes. Two points. Brunson's got eight here in this quarter. They've been a little soft with their defense on the interior. For Cleveland, they've gotten three of seven attempts in this fourth quarter to fall. Mitchell against Quickly. The Cavaliers again cannot hit. The Knicks have gotten seven of nine from the floor in this fourth. Shoots from 14, and it's Niang with a rebound. Niang's got four rebounds in the game. Inside, here's Wade. The basket drops, and he gets fouled on the shot. One free throw coming his way. Well, hit a man in stride. That is a textbook delivery. And a moment now to quickly take a look at the offensive approach for the Knicks. Yeah, what stood out to me was their passing. They moved the ball effortlessly and have been able to find those Find holes the in the defense. The They've also made a concerted effort to get the ball down low. Many of their points coming in that painted area tonight.
Here's quickly. Pass to Hardenstein. Left side, Brunson. Quickly, outside. The three is up. And the Knicks, another three. I love the efficiency he's playing with tonight. Not scoring as much as usual, but he's been effective and they're winning. Allen with a screen on Brunson. Pass to Wade. Mitchell feeling it out a bit. Just five to shoot. Oh, Mitchell gets it done inside. Boy, right from the opening tip, guys. Mitchell was focused and locked in, and he is doing damage offensively. Now here's Brunson, guarded by Garland. Quickly, outside. Let's the three fly. Yes, and a nice assist from Brunson. Brunson's got his seventh assist of the game with that last one. Pass to Mitchell. Oh, and Mitchell powers it home! How high was Donovan Mitchell? How pretty was that dunk? My goodness. Oh, doing damage above the rim. That was our AT&T 5G slam cam. And so it's Brunson with it. He brings it up for the Knicks. Outside Hart. Outside, four on the clock. The rebound by Donovan Mitchell. Cleveland has gone one for five shooting from the arc here in the fourth. Garland, the pass to Mitchell. Connects from downtown. Mitchell's got 14 points here in the second half. He's done everything he can to give them a lift tonight, but it hasn't been enough. Brunson against Garland. Now here's Brunson. Defense is right there. Off with the layup. Cleveland has gone two of six so far in the fourth. Now Garland. Has to wait. Beyond the arc. Randall pulls down the board. Randall's got four rebounds now. to the paint. Ooh, stolen by Allen. And now the Cavaliers on the break. Uh, this is exactly the kind of aggression from Darius Garland that changes the feel of the game, just works his way inside and forces the defense to foul. At the line, two shots. Shoot two. First free throw is good. Well, we know that injury ended Darius Garland's college career right at its infancy. But this guy smartly used his recovery time to focus on getting ready for the NBA. And boy, he's proven he can be a gifted player. R.J. Barrett, he's checked in for New York. And a switch here also for Cleveland. Evan Mobley, he's checked in for Wade. Garland hits them both. New York has gone three for three from downtown in this fourth quarter. Outside Brunson. Pass to Barrett. And here's Brunson. Quickly with a screen on Garland. Four on the clock. Randall, good. They're getting torched on the perimeter. Four of the last five buckets have been threes. Here's Mitchell, outside Garland. Allen with a screen on Brunson. Garland for three. Counted from distance. Garland's got five points now in the quarter. Oh, Darius Garland asserting himself. The answer back from distance. Garland against Brunson. 11 feet out. And the rebound goes to the Cavaliers. A minute 58 left in the fourth quarter. 
Mitchell against quickly. Mobley is screen on quickly. Here's Mitchell. And Mobley with the basket on the assist by Mitchell. Uh, Donovan Mitchell on time and on target. Pretty pass. New York has gone 4-4 four four from outside during the fourth. Quickly outside. A minute 35 left in the fourth quarter. And it's good for two. And with the defender right on him, nice step back. The Cavs trailing. Mitchell with the ball. Can he keep it going? And the rebound goes to the Knicks. Randall's got five rebounds in the game. Pass to Brunson. Outside Barrett. Launches it. The rebound by Allen. That's an unwise shot. I'm sure coach and teammates would have preferred to swing the ball for a better opportunity. Ooh, making his presence felt here. He's now six for nine in this game. Big Jared Allen outshining the bright lights. And New York shooting 55% for the game so far. Brunson against Garland. And they go to the intentional foul. Darius Garland. Second personal foul. First team foul. Forty-four seconds left in the fourth quarter here. Pass to quickly from the arc. And no good as the first free throw misses. We'll see if he can hit the second. And he ends up making the second. And that makes it a seven point lead. Cleveland calls timeout. They're down by seven. 35 seconds left to play in the fourth quarter of this one. Your thoughts, guys? Not much time left. You think they have a chance to come back? Thirty-five seconds left to play in the fourth. Here's Mitchell. Pass to Mobley. Back to Mitchell. Here's Garland. It falls! Oh, and that cut!
cuts the lead to just five. Absolutely fearless is Darius Garland. Clutch shot, no problems. And so they foul intentionally. Julius Randle at the line, two shots. And he misses the first one. Boy, he wanted that one to go. It seems to me Julius Randle improves every season. And the more responsibility he's given, it seems the better he performs. And that trip coming up empty. Missing both. Cleveland calls timeout. They trail by five. 23 seconds left in the game. All right, guys, what's your take? And they're going to have to work fast coming out of the timeout. This is the very definition of desperation mode right now. They need a quick shot and a quick foul. Here are the Cavaliers now. It's a five-point game. The three from Mitchell. Back to Okoro. Fires the three. It's rebounded by New York. The biggest lead of the game, 15 points. And now they decide to foul intentionally. Isaiah Hartenstein. Gets the first, and that increases the lead to six. And so he drops them both, and it's a seven-point game. Here's Mitchell. Pass to Okoro. From downtown. Oh, he buried the three. You love how hard Okoro works for his team and makes himself right there a good option in the catch-and-shoot game. And so the big win by New York in a tight game. And this is a critical win for them. They grab the lead in the series after splitting the first two games. Yeah, game three feels like a game seven if the series is tied. It has a huge impact. They're in the driver's seat now as long as they don't lose their focus. Well, that'll do it for now. Glad you could join us during the first round of the Eastern Conference playoffs. For Allie LaForce, Grant Hill, and Doris Burke, this is Brian Anderson. Thank you for watching tonight's game as New Balance presents our player of the game.
Jalen Brunson. 